Hey guys, Hori Esquivel here. Uh, recently I've taken a break from YouTube. I should have been working on some shit, but I didn't. Uh, and this video is going to explain why. Uh, because I've been really, really, really into Tetris. And here, here are some runs. Uh, I'm going to explain some of the runs that I did. Um, I think my top three runs, or the most... The top three most notable runs that I've done recently. At least in my opinion. I'm gonna get some things out of the way first, though. All the runs that you see here are run on Null Pomino, which is a cross-platform, open-source Tetris fan game. Also, I didn't really customize anything other than the keys that I used, and, you know, a little bit of the repeating key presses... Uh, when it's held down. That's the only thing I, I, I really customized. I didn't customize the background or you know the sound effects or anything like that. Not even the resolution. I did play around with it, but I immediately changed it back when it when I figured it was too big for my uh, my screen. That's the only thing that I've done here. Um, and the other thing I want to get out of the way is that these runs are by no mean by no means the most stellar, you know, best runs or, you know, world record runs, whatever you want to call it. They're nowhere fucking close to that. So, <laughs> props to the guys who get it under, like, 20 seconds, you know. You guys are the actual gods. And, you know, they inspired me to get uh, my PB down to, um... Uh, two under a minute, which is pretty amazing to me at least Because I'm not all that fast. Whatever. Let's let's get right into the right into the video. This first one is um, Was a PB of 106.91 Which I, I mean I guess was was the best at the time. I didn't think I could do any better than that So let's just jump right into it the mind of uh, a Tetris God, I guess Right off the bat, we don't really see anything, you know, extraordinarily great or grand. It's just me stacking fucking blocks at the beginning. You do see a bit of hesitation every now and then, which is, um, some things that I address later. And, and the one thing that I do keep doing a lot in this video, you'll see a lot of, is... Switching pieces or rotating pieces when I don't really have to do it. It's it's just a habit of mine to you know over ro rotate things. I don't know why. Here 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 was a big mistake. I left that one spot open for no discernible reason. I probably should have cleared that up as quickly as I could. Uh, maybe I was thinking that the pieces weren't you know, align properly, or they didn't give me the right set of pieces. Right here, I also mess up by clearing, you know, one line at a time. And whoop the fucking do there was my PB at the time of 106.91. I don't exactly remember this run as, you know, being the most stellar at the time. I really wanted to get that sub one. But I said, you know what, this is an improvement. This is great. This is an improvement. This was achieved on December 30th, 2018. Which, you know, says a lot because I should have been working on a yearly roundup video. <laughs> and that should have came out already, but it didn't, so... We're here now, guys. Anyways. I don't exactly remember what happens or, you know, what I was listening to. Usually when I, uh, when I played, uh, you know, a 40-line race Tetris game, I usually listen to, you know, maybe some, uh, some Joyner Lucas, you know, shout out to him for being one of the best rappers or the best rapper right now. Um, maybe some Joji. I don't know if you guys, uh, think that Joji is a great, you know, choice because all of the slow shit that he does, but... I don't know, it soothes me, it, it, it works, it helps. 
this next run actually was uh, one that I remember distinctly uh, having a, a Joyner Lucas song being played in the background. Um, another thing that I should note though is these runs uh, were saved on a replay thing. So I'm just playing back the replays of it. Not necessarily the game itself, which is why there's no commentary uh, on top of it, which is why I'm doing this. Uh, you know, a look back on uh, the, the Tetris runs that I've done. But without further ado, further ado let's uh, see this 101, 31 second, uh, 31 second, well, fuck you, it's not how you say it. Whatever, this next run. Uh, this was actually a surprise because uh, every single day from the beginning, uh, I'll start right here. From the beginning, um, I've always improved at least once, uh, at least one run. Uh, but every two, every every run that I would do would be two seconds less than my previous run, which I consider you know pretty good. There was a bit of hesitation with that O block right there, which I think really would have uh, cemented this being uh, a sub one run. But you know, whatever. You you can't always get what you want. <laughs> you know, I'm just feeling the Joiner Lucas vibes right here. Nothing really special about this, except the major choke right at the end. Right there, right there. Oh god. It was a mess right there. I don't know exactly what I was thinking, but... I had felt that I had fucked up. My One of my mistakes usually is looking at the time, because I, I just really needed to see that sub one. And, uh... Admittedly, I probably shouldn't have done that right near the end. Probably should have just said, you know what, I'm, I'm gonna do it. I did look at the time a few times. I'm, I'm, I'm not really clear. Probably when I was rotating that O block, rotating that O block for no fucking reason. Um, or messing around and then, you know, eventually holding the O block uh, is when I checked the time. Why? Don't understand. I don't know. I don't care. Um... That goes to show that you know if if you if you have the the goal in mind, uh, usually it doesn't always work out for you for some reason. So yeah, uh, don't look at the time at all. <laughs> if you want to attempt something like this, don't look at the time. Just you know focus, do what you got to do, and hopefully you can get a PB. <laughs> uh, but this run is the one that I hold in high esteem. Because, uh, you know, it's a sub one. It was my first sub one. Um, this is actually where I figured I should just, you know, give up on Tetris. Because I'm not all that great. But, uh, here, here is the run that had sealed my fate as a Tetris god. And, you know, just right off the bat. Again, nothing special. Just regular stacking of the blocks. Uh, this one was actually played in silence, so there was no music that I was listening to, just pure silence. Uh, this was about the time that I was about to give up. I had taken so much fucking shit from this game that I said, you know what, I, I think it's time to throw in the towel that, that, that sub one is probably never going to happen. I hadn't looked at the time just yet. Um... You'll figure out when I see the time when I when I get to it. Um, here was a huge mess up by me. I probably should have just continued on. Right here is when I checked the time. You can see that slight bit of hesitation. Um, and and right there too, right the the hesitation. <laughs> God, that felt horrible. That one. Stupid eye block. It, I mean, it probably would have, wouldn't have made that much of a difference. 
considering, uh, you know, I was already at the end. Four lines would have done it. Who cares? Whatever. But that I don't know how much it would have changed the entire thing. Considering, you know, that I needed one more line after that. Probably wouldn't have changed much. Who knows? Um, there was another mistake that I made, was which is uh, not using that O block. I could have improved this time a lot more than, you know, what you're seeing here. But the point is, you know, I did it. So let me run it back from the I block. <laughs> I hesitate and then I drop it. And then right then and there, I'm thinking, holy shit, what did I just do? <laughs> It was a major fuck up on my part, so I'm I'm scrambling to think. You know what can I do here? What uh what's my new options? Uh, that are what are my options that are available to me? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? And I'm just suffering in silence. I probably should have put on some music at this point, but I didn't. So I continued on this. You know this whole overthinking shit. To the point that I probably could have messed this time up. But then um, the red block, I forget the names at this point. Um, I set it down right there. You know, I guess it's a rookie, a rookie move to, to be honest. But then this, the, for some reason, I was blessed to have another eyepiece right at the end. And it comes through because... That clears three lines, but then I have to do another one line. I thought I was done, I think. But then my mind was like, oh shit, I'm not done. So, another bit of a hesitation there. Uh, the L block and then T block ends the run right there. Luckily for me, it was a sub one, and I'm proud of it. Who gives a shit if you think it's terrible? I think it's pretty damn great. Um... There are going to be some other links in the descriptions to check out if you love Tetris. I love Tetris. You know, I did that one video on Tetris uh, and Puyo Puyo memes that you can check out somewhere on the screen right now. I know this is another weird video. You can also check out all the other runs that I've done uh, that were included in this video. The five, uh, the 58-46 run, the 101-31 run, and the 106-91 uh, run. They're not great runs, um, but I'm pretty damn proud of them. Uh, I don't know why I am. It's just how I am. But, uh, yeah, that, that, that was uh, the reason why I haven't been making videos, and I was a lazy asshole this entire time. I love me some Tetris, man. With that being said, this is me, guys, Jorge Esquivel. If you like what you saw, please leave a like, comment, or what I should or should not do. Subscribe if you want some more. This is me, guys. I'm out.